It's a good sound though, man. I you do. Know? It really is. If I can only win your life, I'd give my heart to make it live. You never know how much I give if I can only win your life. March 31st, I just did some recording with Bucky Hayes. Uh, did some tape recording stuff, talked about his website. Uh, now I'm going to rehearse with Matt Linney, who I've played with for a very long time. So we're gonna go make some music with Bobby McCullough. And uh, we're here at Flood Studios. It's a beautiful locale here. King Williamsburg. And uh, we're gonna play some music. Like, I don't think so. You don't think so? Like, that's what I was saying. That's one of those places where I was like, are there, is it, a, did he, like, is he pumping up those twos? <laughs> I'm not sure yet. I mean, that's obviously like a totally specific thing to. Right, right, right. I don't think it's right. Hello. It's all, like, doesn't he's not a he's not a flashy guy. But he just doesn't do anything. I, I was talking to. Him, I was like, why aren't you like? I know I, I not really like his band, but I said like, in the meantime, like if I if I was him, he's. A Josh, how, how was your experience at Mars 2112? My experience was galactic and Mars-tacular, wow. as advertised. Remember when like, my brothers interviewed the, the skull oh, shaker? Oh my god, yeah. And like, John was like, oh, it was like Dave Matthews, but better. Hi. Hi. We're here at Mars 2112. It's a restaurant in Times Square. Um, for my friend this is uh, going away parts through New York. Um, so it's an interesting spot. I dig it. I don't think it's right.